The lights of his police car activated in a siren screaming. Portly Police Chief Keith Bendel raced to an emergency meeting with a Port Authority official on the morning of September 9th, 2013. Chief Bendel told the jury here when the Bridgegate trial, which is in its second day at the federal courthouse in Newark, that he and his deputy occasionally took their car on the opposite side of the road, driving against traffic to make their way through Fort Lee's clogged streets. That traffic jam is at the center of the trial, allegedly ordered by Governor Chris Christie's allies when the mayor of Fort Lee didn't endorse the governor for the governor's reelection campaign in 2013. The chief said that when he got to that meeting with Robert Durando, who operates the George Washington Bridge for the Port Authority, he asked why were Fort Lee's streets clogged with cars early on a Monday morning? The answer from Durando, a traffic study. The chief said at that point he lost it, yelling at Durando, saying that he had a missing four-year-old, a car crash into a building, and someone that had gone into cardiac arrest, and first responders were not able to move around the town to deal with those problems. The chief took it one step further, telling Durando, if anybody dies, I am going to tell them to f***ing sue you and the entire Port Authority. Now, Bendel is one of just a handful of witnesses that we'll hear from over the course of this trial, including Mayor Sokolich, who started his testimony Tuesday afternoon. But there are more than 300 potential witnesses on a list that was just released today. The question of the potential jurors filled out two weeks ago includes the names of people who might be called to testify in the Bridgegate case. Tops among them, Governor Chris Christie and Governor Andrew Cuomo. The list also includes Essex County Executive Joe DiVincenzo, Lieutenant Governor Kim Gudagno, and yes, Declan O'Scanlan, the Monmouth County Assemblyman, who's been a frequent guest on this show. Now, not all the people on the witness list will definitely be called. Probably only some of them will. But they need to be placed on the witness list so that the jurors could be vetted properly. For more updates from the Bridgegate trial, follow me at Chasing Zidane or the show at Chasing News.